Hello and a warm welcome to the Winkler Method. Take any water source you want, the swimming pool, the fountain, the tap, whatever you've got. Try to keep out excess air. Introduce some MN2 plus ions into your water. We use manganese chloride. You don't have to. You can use any salt. It doesn't matter about the volume here. We're just trying to introduce the ions. We'll worry about uh, volumes later. Next step, we need to add some 4 molar sodium iodide sodium hydroxide. Precipitate our manganese hydroxide, MnOH2. Uh, once that's precipitated, give it a good shake. Then add some very strong acid, 50-50 volume for volume, concentrated sulfuric with water. This gives this beautiful, beautiful golden iodine, which we titrate against sodium thiosulfate. Concentration 0.018 moles per decimeter cubed. 13.1 cm cubed was our value. So let's have a look at the chemistry. MN2 plus was introduced down the neck of the volumetric flask, precipitating the insoluble manganese hydroxide. Next, we took the manganese hydroxide and we added the alkaline iodide to it. The precipitated manganese hydroxide reacted with the oxygen dissolved in the, wa in the water to make us our manganese 3 hydroxide. This we dissolved with the excess concentrated 50-50 sulfuric acid to make Mn3+. This reacted then with iodide to make the beautiful golden iodine solution and some Mn2 plus ions. We finally titrated the iodine from the second part of step 2 with thiosulfate, making our S4 of 6 2 minus and 2 iodides. So let's look at the ratios. Thiosulfate, S2 of 3 2 minus to iodine is 2 to 1. And then 3 plus to iodine, let's have a look. It's in the second part of the second step. So the ratio is also 2 to 1. Thank you very much indeed for watching, comment, like, subscribe at the bottom, have a great day.